Um, I'm doing a continuation today of um, a native piece. Uh, so I've started at the top with um, like a portrait of a, of a native lady with a um, wolf headdress on. Um, then I started an Indian chief, um, which we're going to be finishing today. I've just got to finish the headdress, headdress off, which is sort of around the elbow area um, and the back of the arm. And then if we've got time, we'll get started on the inside. But yeah, proper enjoyable piece. So, so is it first day back? No, I'll, I'll come back on Tuesday. Oh yeah, I did see it actually. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I hate listening to myself. I've been watching the wedding video as well. <laughs> listening to myself self speak. It's horrible. Man. Oh, it's just minging. Yeah. Absolutely, and I've yeah. said a couple of bits wrong as well. I think I went to say modern day love story, and I was like, modern day love well, story. <laughs> and I was like, speech? yeah. I thought it was good. I yeah. thought it was really confident. Oh, mate, I was absolutely breaking it. Yeah, I've got to do a speech at um, Scott's. I bet. When's that? September. Yeah, I was right till I got up, and my legs went. I went out, I thought I had <laughs> a shaking. Right, and I went out, and I went. I thought, well, I let my legs out. <laughs> I looked my legs out, then my arms started shaking. I was like, oh my god. Yeah, proper. Freaking it, man. Oh, well, once dude. you get a first couple of laughs, whatever, you feel better. You relax in there, a yeah. bit. Yeah, big time. So, what are you doing today? Um, Indian Chief today. Um, mm -hmm. Finishing it off, I started on the forearm with a cover up, but I just got to finish off the headdress, and then we're going to get started on the inside if we can. Oh, nice. Like a native sleeve. as it gets further around the back of the arm, but it's all right. <laughs> down it, down it. <laughs> I just, I can't take it. Yeah, I just got weird. I literally had to have like little bits of it. Yeah, yeah they put it in the fridge and then my missus come home and I was still like, <laughs> I'm, I'm dying around the house. I was, and I had to literally, it was like a cocaine addiction or something. I'm gonna have a word with Sam and Sam's fella is a hairdresser and I'm gonna ask him if he can dye this bad boy grey. I think it's gonna look really good. <laughs> wow. What colour are you going? You wait, it is a bit grey. Fuck off, <laughs> will it? <laughs> that is looking so good though. Oh, I'm loving this tattoo. That yeah, is this looking is powerful. Awesome. Yeah, mate. That's awesome. them wolves, that wolf and the trees to go on the inside, tucking oh, behind everything yeah. inside here. Yeah. Just feel yeah, like awesome. sort of What are you going to do up the top then? Uh, we're going to go with eagle. an eagle, like an eagle. Oh, yeah, I think nice. we'll do a close up of the portrait of it as well, or something possibly. Yeah, it's Get a good the face flight. in there nice and big. I love the sizes that you use as well, yeah. just filling it up. Yeah, yeah. 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 I, I yeah, used to make the mistake detail. going too small and you've got an awkward gap, ain't yeah, you? Exactly. Just massive, You've only got to fill it with something. Yeah, exactly. Do you know what I mean? Like a bit of whatever. Yeah. So you might as well just fill it up with quality pictures. I just think that's quality. So we're just thinking maybe we'll try and get a picture of that. I just think we, ultimately we need six six quality pictures for the event. And yeah. you know, I just think jump on it. It's funny. Thank you. See you in a bit, mate. See you in a bit. Thank you. Bye bye. Now we've got a few guest spots coming in. Um, from all over the world, actually. Well, exciting, isn't it? From Espanol. Espa lots from Spain. <laughs> Harry likes them from Spain. <laughs> I do like a Spanish. When did you say the first um, guest spot is coming? Uh, end of April. Yeah, so that's pretty soon, isn't it? And there's definitely going to be like 100% at least one or two days when all the other guys are in. We all done then? Oh, yeah, all done, mate. How's it looking? Yeah, it's looking cool. Oh yeah, nice. Love it. Yeah. Good work, yeah, Scott. Right Cheers, mate. Um, yeah, he's done, so we've got this finished today, and he's done cover up down this side, which has been, works out really, really well. Um, started off as a wolf theme tattoo, and Scott sort of gave me a lot of the ideas, and then come up with this chief, which I'm really, really pleased with, so it's amazing. And then we got that, obviously, that he's done before, so. Yeah, I was really excited to get it finished, to be fair. It's quite hard when you've leave, left it halfway, and. Uh, yeah, just look forward to getting it all done and look forward to the next piece now too. But yeah, cover up, cover ups work really, really well. Um, yeah, chuff with it. Yeah, that's smart, isn't it? Yeah, nice. Yeah, cover up was brilliant. Oh, oh that's yeah. worked. Yeah. I'm 
doing some peonies and some chickpeas. Um, it's pretty cool. It's like a really fine lined sort of design. Um, so I'll be using my single liner um, needle. Essentially, I'm just going to be using um, standard black and a bit of white as well for highlight. Um, but yeah, it's just pretty straightforward. Nice little bit of dot work. Hello, I've got a tattoo at half ten with Louise. Olivia? Yes. Uh, so it'll be going diagonally on like the bicep. I think this is probably going to be a bit too big, but I'm going to resize it so it sits nice for her arm. Uh, I hope it's going if, if it diagonals like down a little bit. Sort of more like that. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, so I'm having um, some like flowers on my arm, I've got like a peony in the middle um, with some sweet peas and some little like foliage coming off it. Um, it's all in like black and it's like dot work, really like fine lines and I'm getting it because I got um, a voucher as a present and it's my birthday tomorrow so the final amount is being paid for my birthday. <laughs> <laughs> they go ham. They go fucking ham. Mate. What is ham? Ham. They go dude, fucking dude, sick. We're old. Oh, I'm proper old. I don't even know what ham is. <laughs> no, that's bad. They go absolutely wild. They go ham. <laughs> I'm gonna be. Uh, the worst thing is when you're getting old and you say for something like that. It's just cringy in it. Really, I'm past that point where I can actually say they go ham. <laughs> There's no ham going in that one. <laughs> yeah, I've still got a little bit left to do, but. I quite like it like this. <laughs> it's not been too bad. It stings a little bit, but... Cool, we're all finished. Um, so yeah, it went really well. Um, client wanted it really light and really pretty, so yeah, here we go. Um, it's gone literally better than I could have imagined when Louis sent the design yesterday. I was so happy and then it's just turned out even better. So I'm really happy. And it didn't hurt too much either. <laughs> Video from the website, the new website. So I'm just watching that quickly because he's asked me some questions. Is that? Um, it's ice cream van. <laughs> Basically, he's like basically a rocket scientist. He's basically he, he is a rocket scientist. <laughs> well, I'm qualified astrophysicist. Well, there you go. Some of that. Don't do that anymore. Woohoo! I love it. No, no, we just have buses instead. Astrophysicist getting a tattoo. Well, there is another one we're planning on doing, but cool. I can't say because there's an NDA, and if you film it and put it on, I'll get shot. Wow! Oh, fuck we'll me. Turn the camera I mean... off. I'll tell you about it. <laughs> that is so cool. Strokes. Is that up for a bit? That Marcus, go on tour. Monumental bus? Monumental the monumental bus. movement. Hashtag monumental bus. Oh. <laughs> that would actually be double cool, wouldn't it? You end up with people like this in the chair that you least expect, and it's the most interesting conversation yeah. ever. And and it just goes to show you, you know, when you try and stereotype people with tattoos, that you, it's rubbish, basically. I don't own a motorbike. I don't know, however, <laughs> don't you go. Like, it's one of the things I used to love about tattooing, like, the people, you know, like, yeah, you're getting to do the things like you you know you get proper excited about doing the design so you're doing something you, you love and then you also get to have like great chats great conversation great banter all day it's like a win-win you got to give all your heart if you want to you got to give all your i love it that it looks really random but it's so specific how's that feeling good if good means hurt. Okay, so um, 
we finished and it's amazing. I couldn't be happier with the work. Sam is insanely good. Look at the line work, look at the colours. It's amazing. I'm really keen on colour, neo-traditional style, so yeah, I think it's turned out great. And it's such a, it means something, so it's really cool. Yeah, up until the white, um, it, it didn't even really hurt that much. Um, but the white was quite painful. Um, but you did it with care, it was kind. Um, so I'm very, very happy with this. It's a superb work. Um, and of course it means so much to me that uh, it's always going to be there, but then, then it's not. If you need to hide it, you can hide it. <laughs> yes, that's it. Not true. You got the rhythm of your heart if you want to. You got the rhythm of your heart if you want to. You got the rhythm of your heart. Back pain, that's yes. one thing I can say. Back pain. Can you change my back? No. Mm. Yeah, tattoo is going well. Very well. I'm happy with it so far. I'm a jack of all trades, master of none. To, to the point, really. Yeah, so I work at Tesco's part time. I teach English in the summer, to, in the summer schools in Clacton. Um, I deliver Chinese food Thursday and Saturday nights. I want to do creative stuff as well, so I sort of write short stories for iBooks and produce a little bit of electronic music. I've got a few songs on iTunes, yeah, but that's more of a hobby. Yeah, so all together, yeah, I keep busy. So I don't even know how I found time to have a day setting, really. <laughs> a day session, yeah. Busy man. Good to be busy, though. I love key skills. <laughs> Um, finding that a trolley coin could be, I mean people will use it won't they? Do you use trolley coins? I do use do trolley you, coins. Do you do really? this? Yeah. Oh well there you go look. Do you use trolley coin Richard? Okay. Whop it out. You, you are? I'll risk it. Basket. No, we'll carry a basket. Oh, I'll risk it. I'll risk it. I'm not risking losing my bag. Don't risk a trolley coin. Yeah. Yeah. That could be a go though. What about, um, did you manage to get any much stuff to go in the bags? I'm just struggling to think. Yeah. I need to maybe go into Culture Star. And just go like around steam some, in a few shops. Go around some places. Yeah. I think just leave that till last thing. Because mm. worst case scenario, we don't give a bloody bag away. So we can leave that as like last week. Maybe you can just, yeah, bug off up town one day. And, but there's more important things. You know I mean, I'd rather your headspace be in the things that really matter. Yeah. Rather than trying to make up a bag for people who probably just chuck it in a bin when they go. Okay. <laughs> and while you're in town, if you happen to see some geezer who's just like whopping it out. <laughs> just, uh, get his number. Yeah, get his number. There are parts of town where you will definitely see. <laughs> <laughs> How do you know that, Richard? <laughs> he knows a lot about strange things. <laughs> <laughs> that is a big old melon you got there, to be fair. It took me so long to find a snowball because it's so freakishly low. It's 57 centimetres. How did you know you're just so high? So it's a measure of it. He knows the exact size of his head. It's because I was like blown away. It's like the large, next large ones are all like 52, 53 oh. centimetres. Stupid head. <laughs> Stop it! Stop it! See that? So yeah, it went very well. Uh, very happy with it. Did really good time as well. Um, it's really nice and smooth. Some smooth shading, nice contrast. I love it. Yeah, so absolutely delighted with it. Most amazing piece. Um, so happy with it. Couldn't have gone any better. Work of art, if I do say so myself. Hi, I'm at Monumental Inc. to get my first tattoo of two otters. Um, it's going to be black and 
black and grey, <laughs> just dot work and line work. Um, it's just something that I've always wanted, so yeah, I'm really excited. Um, so I'm just doing two little otters today, um, Lincoln Arms, it's a really cute piece, and um, it's for Isla and her mum, as she just told me. And it's going to be in dot work, and I'm just mainly using black and maybe a little bit of white for highlights. How's the pain? It's alright. It's not that bad. <laughs> it's bearable. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's bearable, like, it's worth it. I was really nervous, but it's like, it's actually okay. Like, now I'm really used to it. It's alright. Once you get like, the first line down, yeah. the nervousness goes away completely. Yeah. yeah. Oh, so, we're all done. Yeah. Thank you so much. Right. I'm going to get a stop looking at it. It's crazy. <laughs> Um, so yeah, I think it went really well. Isla's really happy with it. It looks really cute. So it's finished now and it looks exactly how I wanted and I love it and it's, it went really well. Those eyes. Yeah, came up pretty good. That is so good. That is so good. I love the colours. Yeah, you're gonna love it. I can't see it, so. <laughs> <laughs> what I've seen of it, I absolutely love. Yeah. It's so good. But yeah, so so how do you think it went today? It went really well. Um, colours are looking absolutely fantastic. Aggie's done another wonderful job. It took a little bit longer than I thought it will because of blending all the colours. Um, I've added a nice contrast background behind the whole portrait so it makes it stand out a little bit more. And yeah, I've got a nice set of skin tone colours that make a nice full realistic effect on the face. I'm really happy how it turned up um, and yeah um, I can't wait to see it, heal see it healed actually. How was your tattoo today, mate? Yeah, man, really good. Yeah. The colours are really good. That's it. Yeah, yeah, I was a little bit worried because it was um, like so specific, mm. but it turned out really well. Yeah, yeah, really cool. What was yours? Yeah, all right. Done two little waters, they were cute as fuck. Oh, yeah. They came out really nice, so yeah, pretty buzzing brown. Sick. So, guys, how'd it go today? Yeah, good. Yeah, man. Good, Sweet. yeah? Really good. Yeah, pretty cool. Yeah. yeah, got some nice bits done. No one passed out. Almost. No. <laughs> my, my first she person did, almost she? Almost did. a little bit. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Yeah, first couple of lines. Nice. Yeah. What have you got tomorrow? Um, can't remember. Yeah, I can't I've remember got a long right day now. session tomorrow. I've no? got a compass in and I'm continuing to sleeve. What is it? It's like a combination. It's yeah. loads of different things. Like There's another specific one. It's got loads of really specific elements. It's got like a tiger, mm. a skull, poppies. A oh, Yorkshire the, rose. Um, was that the one with the bike? The yeah, bike and he wanted a bike in it, so I basically made a Polaroid picture mm. and put a bike in the picture instead oh, of nice. just having like a bike popping out of Love the innovation. Yeah. Yeah, it's cool, man. That's what I'm here for. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> nice. All right, guys, good work. Yeah. Right. Uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, see right. Bye bye. See you later. Bye. Bye. Thank you for watching. If you like what you see, hit the like button, comment in the bar below, and don't forget to subscribe.